Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to Subsistence Land. Uh, we're just sort of up here on the uh, the end of our base here, uh, observing a level three bear. <laughs> and then if we go to the other end, let's go take a peek. Let's take a boo at what's going on over here. Um, less immediate excitement, but I'm pretty sure there is something. Uh, oh, we got a level level nine chicken. We're gonna have to keep an eye on that. We got. Oh, is that a Oh, that's an ammo crate. Oh, oh, okay. Um, I'm not going to jump down because I've already broken my... Oh, no, no, let's do this. There we go. There we go. Let's go get that ammo crate. Uh, now, uh, I do have... Oh, what, what's my fire at? Not bad. Good. Uh, we do have a plan for today. I There is a plan, uh, and it has to do with... Oh, hello, bear. Yes, there is a bear. Hmm. Well, let's get this... Uh, Let's get this ammo crate, and we'll talk about the the plan. Um, so as many of you may know, uh, at this point, it is September. It is now uh, Angry Moose time. <laughs> oh, and by the way, I'm making uh, boards and cordage. So that's what that, that's what that noise in the background was. Um, hang on a second. There we go. <laughs> it was, it was uh, you couldn't hear it, but I could. I had my... Uh, uh, headphones and my speakers on at the same time and it was very disorienting <laughs> I don't usually do that now uh, the 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 mooses the the, the angry mooses is, is, is. the the thing about them is that well they're angry <laughs> the other thing about them is that they're kind of big and powerful and uh, I don't I, 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 I seem to have a blind spot hey rabbit how you done uh, I seem to have a blind spot for detecting them, like when they're nearby. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the just the the nature of the sounds that they make. Or uh, usually, the first time I hear them is when they're running away, and it's like uh, the last thing I want is for them to basically come up on me and oh, that reminds me, shotgun, yes, uh, and yeah, let's go. Cool. Okay, uh, come up upon me. Ooh. Well, we'll leave Mr. Wolf alone. Well, uh, yeah, let's do it. We've got the arrows. And oh, <laughs> into the drink. Into the drink he goes. All right. So uh, the moral of the story is I don't have anything that has near the pa firepower that I should in order to deal with a moose effectively. Uh, there's only one thing that I I've personally had good luck with. Now I know there's there are strategies, and I could uh, you know uh, a fully upgraded 44, for example, is quite powerful. And uh, yeah, but uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be making today. We're going to make a double barrel shotgun, or at least we're going to we're going to do the 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 re prep re prep work for it. Um, we don't have a lot of mass, but we're building up power. And in fact, what I think I'm going to do here, let's grab some more of the uh, fat. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. I, I knew you were going to do that, Mr. Power Supply. But we're going to we're going to double power it this morning. Oh, yeah. I just used a lot of biofuel doing that. But that's okay. We did increase our power storage in the last episode. So we are now up to 3,000. So that's pretty good. And, uh, yeah. The... So I'm going to let that build up, and then we're going to let the uh, mass build up naturally. But really what I want to do is I want to make myself a, uh, a nice, happy little uh, double-barrel shotgun. Now, why the double-barrel shotgun, you might ask? Well, because uh, while it doesn't, I don't think it has, it has a slightly different spray pattern than the, the regular shotgun, but that's not the big deal. I use the shotguns close up, um, so it doesn't really matter. The thing about the double barrel is that you can fire both shells almost one immediately after the other. Like, you can go bang, bang, right? And so, essentially, you get, uh, within the, like, that scope when the animal is coming at you, you get the, the you'll get the, um, uh, you can basically unload two shells. Now, uh, the handy, uh, there is a handy chart out there. It does exist that talks about firepower of various weapons. And the, the double barrel, uh, it, with, with completely unupgraded, uh, does the same as the regular shotgun, which is 120 hit points of damage, right? So that means you can do 240 hit points of damage, um, like within, uh, uh, right up 
in your face, right? Now, I already, I'm also going to be making some premium arrows. Oh, wait a minute. I'm, I'm sort of messed up because I, I still think I have chests over there. And they're not. They're over here. And I think it's this one. Yes. I have two premium arrows, but I have some premium feathers. So we're also going to be making some premium arrows. And all of this is just so that we can get some prep work done for uh, the moose, uh, presumed moose encounters that we're going to be having. So let's take a look at the requirements for actually making a shotgun and start getting some materials together. I do also want to continue upgrading the recurve bow to make it more and more powerful. Uh, but I think that in the short term, oh, I need five ingots. And 200 mass. Ooh. What have I got for ingots right now? Well, um, I have zero. I have zero ingots. Now, let me see if I can do the math on this. Hang on a moment. Let me think about this for a second. Yeah, that's not enough. That's that's zero is definitely less than five. So that's why I wanted to get started on this. So first of all, let's get some more iron happening here. Oh man, does that need? A, I'm gonna need more iron. Uh. Oh wait a minute. Do we have anything in here? Yes. There we go. That's what we want. Oh, and also we wanna let's cook you off as well. Um. Uh, is it copper? I think it's copper. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to see if we can make... What do we got? Oh, I think we barely have enough to make... Uh, we don't have enough uh, mass, though, to make all... Oh, we, yeah, we do. We do. One, two, three, four, five. And we're down to almost no iron again. It's funny how that works out. You always need iron. Uh, well, let's put away some of this stuff as well. While we're here, I'll put you away. You, 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 uh, and you. And then you go, actually, no, in here. Wait a minute. I had a single cloth in there. That was that was terrible. Uh, and you, man. Oh, I got real sloppy sometimes. Okay, there we go. So we're going to have five ingots. So the five ingots is one thing. Uh, let's let's put together all the, the, the things that we're going to need. So we're going to need uh, five boards and 20 uh, weapons parts. So five boards, one, two, three, four, five... And 20 weapons parts. That's not a big deal. We've got almost 60 of the darn things. So that's good. There we go. <clears throat> and what we're going to do is we're going to put this down here in this bottom left-hand corner of this chest. And then we'll have the ingots as well uh, very soon. So once we get all the ingots, then it's just a matter of cranking up the mass. And then we'll be able to make a double barrel shotgun. And then... <sighs> The other thing I want to do... Oh, I guess we should make some premium arrows, too. Now, premium arrows are also made in here. I'm going to make the double barrel first before I start making premium arrows. Oh, they don't take mass. Oh. Yeah, but look at how expensive they are. <laughs> they take an iron fragment. Oh, let's see. Scrap, iron, crystal, and a feather. So, uh, scrap. Let's, let's grab four. Uh, four. <laughs> That's why I grabbed four, by the way. Uh, one, two, three, four. And, uh, wait, 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 wait. What was the other thing? Oh, the, the, uh, the feathers. Oh, is it one feather per? One, two, three, four. Uh, oh, hey, we got the five. Nice. Okay, that's cool. And then, uh, the premium arrows. And then we basically, yeah, it's one air, one feather per. So if we do one, is that going to make one arrow? I think it's probably going to make one arrow. These things are super expensive, which is why I don't make them very often. Um, well, you can see what's going on here. It, they're just really, really expensive. So uh, let's, let's take a look at how many. One arrow is, d I think it's going to definitely be one arrow. It's not like two arrows or, yeah. So let's take the rest of them. There we go. We've got some more. Now I have two already from, I believe I got these out of loot right? And so we do have some premium arrows. Now the premium arrows in a twice upgraded recurve bow is uh, let's see 112 for each arrow. So you could see that it starts to add up. So 120 for two barrels of a shotgun is 240. Plus one uh, premium arrow is 112. So that's 352. Now, I don't remember <coughs> the... Uh, oh, no, don't do that. I don't... Oh, it's raining out. I don't... Oh, oh. 
Let's see if we can get that, that deer. Oh, I missed. Oh, I, I missed his head. I, w I was going for another headshot. But I didn't get the headshot. Oh, there he is right there. Okay, let's see if we can just get him anyways. We'll, we'll, we'll stalk him. Uh, stay safe, girls. Stay safe. <gasps> there he is. There we go. I didn't have to get super specific on that shot because all I needed to do was land it. <laughs> it, it, it wasn't wasn't much more than that. Do, 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 do. More antlers for me. <laughs> okay, let's go back and continue our progress. How are you guys doing? Still a level nine chicken. <laughs> All right, now, let's see. Okay, we've got the four premium arrows. And, yeah. Uh, no, not yet. Okay. So, all right, as far as the uh, the arrows are concerned, so essentially, uh, uh, someone asked how you switch between them. Uh, essentially, you can just hit left alt, and it switches to the premium arrows. Left alt, left alt, right, and it switches between the two, right? And then the other thing, I think you can actually just, uh, what is it? Can you actually, what is it? Do you try, I, I can't remember exactly what it is, but there's another way of doing it. Um, and I, I just, I, I always use the, uh, the left alt method. I can never remember what, if there is a second way of doing it, I can never remember what it is. So I don't really, I, the left alt is, is really the, the, that one just makes sense. Do, 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 do. See, it's super quick and super easy. So might as well just do that now. What's the situation? We're slowly cranking our power up. Um. Hmm. Well, we could cheat a little bit. We could cheat a little bit. I think we. I think we're gonna cheat. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna cheat a little bit with our uh, with our mass fabricator. And the other thing is, I I was uh, I sh if I was smart, if I was prudent. I would basically let this build up to 100 by itself because it's free, and then I would boost the the other 200 up using artificial means. Uh, oh, I'm still yeah. See, my output is is higher than my input, but it's 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 draining fairly slowly. So uh, yeah. But anyways, I would do it that way. But I I really want that double barrel. So we're for the sake of uh, of 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 speed and all of that other stuff. We're, we're, we're kind of trying to accelerate this a little bit. Now let's put you away and you go in here and antler goes in here. The other thing we could do is we could make some more uh, adhesive. That's probably a good idea. Let's see. It's a, it's a terrible day out, so I'm not really feeling too bad about hanging out here. Uh, we need eight of you because we are going to do, no. Can you count? Yes, I can. Okay. And we need you, and we need you, and we're going to need some more ash over here, because I think it's 50 ash per, but I... Um, that's more than enough. Yeah, it's 50 ash per. So we can do two more batches of adhesive. That's kind of cool. That'll, that's kind of nice. Oh, the other thing I should probably do to be organized is uh, put this here. So there, there's, there you go. That's my... Um, that, if you use your imagination... In it, you can envision this being a double barrel shotgun. Five ingots for a double barrel is very expensive, by the way. That is a lot of ingots. That's a that's a very expensive weapon, which is why I often don't build it. Well, actually, for years, not years, for uh, months or whatever, since it came out, um, I didn't use the double barrel, and it was because uh, how we're we doing, sixty-five. Okay, uh, I didn't use the double barrel. You know what? Let's do some looting while while that builds up. We'll let the, the base handle its little businesses. Um, and let's get some looting going. For years, I didn't use the double barrel. I've talked about it before. Um, and because I always thought, you know, at a simplistic level, like, well, it, it can hold. It has the same firepower. It has a slightly different spread. But it has, uh, it can do two... Uh, only two shots before you have to reload, and the reload animation is cool, but 
you know, I like the regular shotgun better. But uh, that was before I learned the beauty of the, the double whammy that you can do with it. It's uh, really kind of nice. Oh, I think we're seeing some ores. Yeah. Okay, let's... We've got some, something over there. Let's go take a look at this. Now, we do have to be careful with mooses. And I'm a little bit concerned because, I, as I say, uh, my, vi my hearing right now is extremely impaired by the rain. And uh, even at the best of times, I have issues with them. And they will, they are super aggressive right now. They will attack you. So, can I do this? No. Okay. So, swing and jump. Swing and jump. There we go. All right, let's go. Level two bear. See, with a double barrel shotgun and two shotgun shells, you could take out that level two bear. Huh? It's super awesome. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, I forgot the other problem with the the moose. Yeah, it can outrun you. <laughs> yeah, it's faster than you. It's pretty well the only animal that is actually faster than you, other than the cougar, which is marginally faster than you. Yeah, I know. I I, I angered a wolf. He's prop. I don't know if he's still behind. No, he's 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 fine. Um, let's see what's over here. Uh, is the cougar and so really if with the cougar if, as long as you're somewhat careful you can usually run away if you have enough stamina and maybe with a little bit of luck and some planning you can run away with a moose no there's there's no there's no running away from a moose but once they're mad at you and they're after you you're you're pretty well boned you know what I should be doing is uh, working on Let's do some, uh, my vegetable supply is getting low, so I'm going to, let's get some kelp. Let's see, where are we safe? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I think I, I do need, I do need some kelp. And I also wouldn't mind getting more pearls because uh, I do need to do more upgrades and stuff like that. So, oh, there's one right there. So. But uh, anyway, so yeah, the plan, as I say, today is the double barrel. So we're just going to, we're going to. We're just killing a little time, doing some, being productive, getting some loot on, seeing what we can find. But we're really, what we're interested in is, uh, it's getting that double barrel going. We have some premium arrows, so, uh, I think, I think the level three, uh, moose has, right, so if we go back to the previous discussion, um, it's like 350 something or whatever, um, if you use a premium arrow and then the double barrel on the moose, you get approximately, it's 350 something hit points uh, taken down with the one arrow and the two shells, right? So you can pull the, the moose with the arrow. So you hit the moose at distance with the arrow and then you can uh, hit him with the double barrel, right? When he gets close to you. Oh, is that scrap? Well, let's get that. We always need scrap. Uh, by the way, I also just like it underwater when it's raining out because it's quieter. <laughs> to be honest with you. <laughs> Come on. That's it. Let's see, watch. Oh, that's so much better. That's so much better. Unfortunately, you can't breathe down there, so you do have to go up. Okay. Do, 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 do. So, yeah, let's just... We'll, we'll make our way back to the base, do a little bit of underwater looting here, and... And uh, that sort of thing. Instead. Hopefully we can make our double barrel today. I don't see why we can't. We should have enough, the ability to generate enough mass. Uh, I think I've got some, we can, oh, you know what I could do? I could start burning some meat. Yeah, maybe we should, we should do that as well. That's a, it's a relatively good, safe, nice way to make some, uh, to, to make some mass, to basically recycle it. Um, okay, let's take a look in here. Wow, not a lot in the uh, the pearl department, is there? There's a nice sandstone down there. Let's get that. Womp. Uh, but anyway, so, the yeah, 350-some-odd hit points from the, that combo, the premium arrow and a double barrel shotgun. 
two two shells. That's unupgraded. That's for the for the double barrel. It, you get more if you upgrade the double barrel. And I think I'm not a hundred percent sure about it because I haven't seen a. I don't have. I don't really observe moose hit points very often, but I think that might be able to kill a moose, a, a level three moose. Which is, you know, that's the highest naturally natural level of moose that you're going to run into. I mean, if you you can get an unnatural one, which is where you let it kill you or it kills a hunter and it gets turns into a level four or level five, then you're in then you're in big big doo doo. <laughs> that's the <laughs> oh 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 we're gonna yeah come on up 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 come on. Getting greedy. All right, but I'm really want. Oh, there's an ore. Okay, let's get that. Oh, it's so much quieter and nicer down here when it's raining out. Definitely an improvement, except for that. <laughs> That's really loud. I think I saw. Oh, is that a? I thought that was a. Oh, it is a sandstone. Okay, well. <gasps> And there's an embarrassingly close wolf, so... Ah, we should be fine. Let's get this. Do, do, do. We do need the sandstone because we are... We do plan on continuing with our glass... Uh, come on, come on. Uh, our glass manufacturing, our conversion of the base into a glass base. I do want to get on top of that. All right, let's keep moving. And there's nothing more here. It's very disappointing. I mean, there's a there's a there's a kelp right there, which I do need, by the way, because I am burning through vegetables. Uh, although that should slow down. Um, basically, now that I'm using uh, steak and eggs for the for the pets or for the animals, uh, my my vegetable consumption should drop. Um, but keep in mind, oh, I only use one plant bed for food. Oh, there's a crate. Uh, the other plant bed I use for, um, uh, for potatoes, for molotovs. So, yeah. Come on. Oh, I'm s getting stuck getting out of the water. That, that, that's an old problem that, I don't know, sometimes it's there and sometimes it's not. Okay, let's just cru take the overland route. It's faster. And check on the base situation. See what we're doing as far as power. Boom, boom, boom. Actually, mass. Well, power and mass. We, we, we are burning a lot of power right now for generating mass. So let's double check that we're, we're still good on that front. Um, you know what? This is actually turning out to be really good. Uh, do I have here? Let's you no know, here. Let's we've got way too much of of. Uh, uh, let's grab that. Let's just burn a whole bunch of liver. Ooh, I gotta remember to fill that up. Okay. Now, do I have? I can't remember where I I store my mass. I do have overflow mass somewhere. There it is, right there. So we can... Let's drop those bad boys in. Womp. And womp. And we're there. Almost. 200. Uh, there we go. R okay. All right. And now we're building up our power again. Yes. Look at that. In fact, what we could do... Actually, no. We're not going to bother. Let's grab you, you, and you. And I have to remember that I have to keep the fires going. And let's make ourselves a double barrel. Yeah, green across the board. Sweet. Awesome. Uh, let's put you in there. I am going to have to probably do more copper. But for now, I'm going to focus. Ah, what the hell. Let's do. Let's just do six of them. There we go. Okay. <laughs> nice. All right, we're going to let that stuff burn, but I do need to, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's grab wood, and let's get those fires sorted because they're they're a little bit, yeah, close. Okay. And, oh, 
You know what? Let's just use it. Um, what is it? Okay, I'm going to put the shotgun. Let's put the shotgun away. And I'm going to switch over to... Here, we'll put that there. The double barrel. Okay. Ha 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 ha. Let's get some light happening in here. There we go. Yeah, we've lost. Yeah, it's gone full dark. I'm not going to... Ooh, wait a minute. Do, is my... <gasps> All right, so... Um, <clears throat> I'm going to... Well, okay. So uh, there's... We need, we, need to, uh, we need to get the appropriate equipment and supplies to take care of you, level 10 chicken. This is a celebratory time for you. Uh, you're you're going on a spa day, so we have to figure out. But we do need equipment. There's like uh, various creams and ointments and baths and like bath salts and stuff. Uh, so I'm going to have to go out tomorrow, and I'm going to have to find uh, all of that stuff. <laughs> That's the story, and I'm sticking to it. Uh, basically, okay. So here we go. This is the. Uh, I was hoping we'd have a bit of light. And I'd be able to show off, the, use the, the double barrel. But maybe what we'll do is, uh, well, we'll see. But there, there we go. Double, and I love the way you reload it. So here, let's, um, can I unload the, unload the weapon? Okay. I love the, lo the, the load animation. Ha <laughs> it's cool. Yeah, this is a, it's a really nice, I really, I didn't like it for a long time. And then, but now I, I just, I thoroughly enjoy it. Okay, you guys burnt yet? Oh, perfect. Okay. I'm going to actually put burnt meat in here, down at the bottom, because it's super convenient and it's near the fires. And I burn meat all the time. All right, let's put away uh, some stuff. Let's put you away. You, is there anything else? Oh, the adhesive that we made. So we're back up to, look at that, 37. We're doing really well on that. Um, put away the... Uh, we'll, we'll cook up... Well, actually, you know what? Here, let's cook up the... Uh, there we go. Uh, you, 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 you. And we got seven kelp. That's not too bad. We have our, our, our uh, premium arrows, which we're going to hold on to at least for during this next little... Uh, the month of September um, for, for when there's angry mooses around because, you know, that's a thing. All right, that's uh, eat, eat. Is that enough? Ah, that's good enough. And uh, yeah, see, so you see what I mean? I've got 12 tomatoes left. Oh, I've got some apples. We can eat those. But I've, I'm, you know, it's, 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 I've got a fair amount of vegetables, but I definitely have less than I'm really comfortable with. So, and then we'll have some water. So tomorrow, we're going to have to try out. We're going to have to... Oh, oh! I think our, we have a... So one of, he's fishing. One of, the, one of our buddies is fishing right now. My personal water. I'm going to get that going. And we're going to do the plants. Let's grab you and you. Get a bit of light going on in here. Uh, grab that, that. Oh! I could have... Two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Ah, let's use all the ash. We, we, it doesn't really matter. Um, perfect. 94 is good enough, I think. Because in a single day, you don't use the, the full thing of water. So, there we go. I think my uh, generator just went out. It got suddenly very quiet in here. So let's go check on that. Yep. Do I have any more um, fat? Yes, I do. Okay. Now these are for me. Um, what is the situation? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do it. Especially when I've got, uh, I've got here, let's split that in half, and then there we go. It'll use twice as much power, but it'll take half the time, so it'll be good. It's the same thing. Uh, there we go. Well, all right, I think we're in good shape. Um, 
I really wanted to try out the the double barrel, but it's just it's dark. So, hmm. I'm not really sure if I want to do this in the dark. I don't think I do. We've got a level level one bear right there. So maybe what we'll do is in the oh what oh we've got rogues. Oh look at that! There's rogues right next to my base. I think in first thing in the morning, what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna take out that bear with the double barrel. Now, the if it's 120 for each one, it's 240. So we basically don't even have to use the preliminary shot on him. We should be able to kill him outright with a double barrel, uh, with both both shells. Um, technically, uh, we don't have to use that. Um, we could probably get away with what is it? Uh, we can get away with the recurve bow with a regular arrow. Plus, uh, yeah, we could do that. I think we can do that. Um, it's a it's somewhere north of 200 for a regular regular arrow from the recurve plus a regular shotgun shell. But that's not the point. <laughs> the point is I want to use both barrels at the same time and let them have it. Give them the, the old double whammy. Now, what is my ammo situation? I have no backup. Uh... See, now this is nice. Look at that. This is nice to have. So I'm going to start using some shotgun shells. So I haven't had to make ammo for quite a while. So I'm going to make uh, a few. That's, I think, good enough for now. There we go. And I, I just wouldn't mind having some, some extras. Uh, we're doing well, I think, for everything else. Uh, let's do... Uh, one oh no 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 we need one more because I'm running around with four four SVT rounds and I think we're good otherwise so let's do this and then once we get uh, then we have three reloads on the SVT we've got way a ton of nine mil because I don't really know what else to do with it and uh, we've got I think enough air regular arrows for now and then we've got six premium arrows so I think we're in good shape. I think we're in definitely in good shape. Now, what I wanted to do, by the way, the reason why I'm making so many shotgun shells is I want to have a... Um, uh, this is my backup weapon. In fact, here, let's do this correctly. Let's do this. Pull this down here. Reload it to get it full. Um, I'm not going to bother repairing it because I'm not planning on... Ah, uh, we should repair it, shouldn't we? What do I need? Uh, boards and scrap. Okay, fine. One, two, one, two. Is that right? Yeah, there we go. It's fully repaired. What do I need to repair you? Boards and scrap. Oh my god. Okay, fine. One, two, one, two. And then we'll repair you. There we go. All right. And then this thing, it, it's going to take adhesive. Oh my god. Uh, one, two. Nope. One, two, three, four. Uh, adhesive. How much adhesive do I need to do this? Repair is two and two. Okay. Uh, one, two, one, two. Oh, that sinew, it, it hurts. But that's the price of using an upgraded weapon. Oh, what the hell. Let's, if we're going to do this right, let's do all of it. Why not? I could wait till it... Yeah, okay. All right, so... Um, this is my backup shotgun. So if, if things go bad, this is my um, recover my body shotgun. So, like, when, you're, when you die, you can, like, pull stuff out of here and give me a shotgun i've got usually my other high powered weapon if i'm carrying the 44 then it's the svt if i'm carrying the svt then it's the 44 so there you go now that's why there's all those um the, the uh all those guns and all that that spare ammo in there we have a bear to take care of oh the birds the birds are flying <laughs> do you see that they're flying south for the winter so bad weather is coming now where did our <gasps> Hello, level 10 chicken. Where did our bear go? Oh! Look at them all milling around out there. Look at all the... the <laughs> oh, that is hilarious. Okay. But that's not our con immediate concern. Our immediate concern is that we have a bear problem. And we have our bear gun. And so... I'm a little, I need to practice because I'm a little out of practice with this situ, with, with this maneuver. It's not complicated or anything like that. I'm just out of practice. Oh, there's a crate over there. Put 
Why is it that all of a sudden I'm having trouble finding a bear? This is not right. Oh, oh, there he is. Okay, here, I'll show you. And that's it. <laughs> that is the beauty of the double barrel shotgun. <laughs> oh, I love it. <laughs> now, that was a, a little wasteful. As I say, I could have gotten away with just uh, an arrow and a single shell. And that's the thing. You could use just a single shell on the double, double barrel shotgun. So, you know, you, you use as much as... It's not like you have to use both barrels at the same time. But it is nice that that is an option for animals that are, uh, let's just say, a little bit more, a little bit more oomph. All right. Let's grab you. And I think we uh, we should call it a day. We're well into the next day, and so I, I went a little long, but that's okay. I don't mind. Uh, I quite enjoy it. There we go. Let's, let's spot. Let's take a look at what's going on up the up the river here. Ah, yes. Yeah, see, look. Is there... Oh, no, that's that's an actual rogue. Okay. There's this campfire. So we've got a rogue camp over there. Mm. A rogue camp, you say? That might be an interesting encounter. I haven't gone after rogues for a while, and they're a real waste of time and, and ammunition, but I'm feeling like I might want to actually... I think it's time we, we, we took out some rogues. So maybe, maybe that's what we're going to take care of tomorrow. I, I think I, I like that idea. All right. And, oh, and the other thing we have to do is we have to start prepping for our Charlie attack. So we are going to be going after... Oh, there's another bear right there. We are going to be going after Charlie. And uh, so I'm going to also start prepping by making Molotovs and stuff like that. So, And we also need to make a breaching charge. So, yeah, we've got a bunch of stuff that has to be done. But, uh, yeah, we're going to work on that. All right. Thank you very much, everyone. Until next time, you all have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye. That's it. You guys, your days are numbered. <laughs> well, I should say your day is numbered. <laughs> All right. Bye.